Okay, so this video is to highlight the fact that sex trafficking is happening in the porn industry. This isn't really a surprise to most people. People have been saying this for, for decades. But now the porn industry has given us more evidence that this is happening. There's a new initiative on the ballot in California this year um, that extends protections to victims of human trafficking and sex trafficking. And it also increases the penalties for those caught trafficking uh, people. And so the porn industry is really against it. They're editorializing against it. They're calling for a rewrite. They're talking about how ridiculous the penalties are. Um, so the penalties, if you're caught trafficking, um, they could extend to life in prison now, not just a couple of years. And the fines for being caught trafficking have increased significantly. Uh, I think this is great. A lot of people think it's great. There's virtually no opposition to this except from the porn industry. My question is, if the porn industry was not forcing and coercing, abusing, drugging its performers sometimes, getting them to perform uh, in the production of pornography, then why are they so afraid of this? My other question is, if the porn industry really is verifying the ages of the performers and they know that all of their performers are over the age of 18, then why are they so afraid of this? Um, you know, activists have been saying this for years, scholars, researchers, Dr. Donna Hughes, Laura Letterer, they've, uh, they speak frequently about this. They have a number of research articles. Um, per former performers talk about this frequently when they, they talk about how they were forced, abused, uh, they were raped, they were slapped. They would show up to a set expecting one thing, and then they were forced to participate in something else. And when they didn't want to, it, it didn't matter. No wasn't a, wasn't a possibility. That's sex trafficking. Um, and so, again, my question is, if the porn industry is not forcing women to engage in uh, these sex acts for porn, then why are they so afraid of these penalties? It won't, it won't touch them at all. Okay, so here's a handout that from the Pink Cross Foundation that talks about trafficking in the porn industry and how it's happening. I, if you want to read it, click the link below and you can um, download a copy yourself. But uh, So beating, slapping, punching, they beat the performers with objects when they don't want to perform. Um, they physically restrain them. They rape and gang rape them. And all of this is filmed. You, you're watching it and you think that this was consensual, but oftentimes performers go to the set thinking that they're going to perform one thing and they're forced to do something else that they don't agree to and don't want to do. This is trafficking. Here's the article from the Porn Industries Trade publication about the new law, talking about how ridiculous it is, especially the new penalties, and calling for a rewrite of the law. My the whole point is they're, they're worried about the penalties for trafficking and using minors, but the porn industry says they're not trafficking and they're not using minors, so why are they afraid? The truth is that they do force women to participate in pornography frequently and to participate in scenes they don't want to, and they do use minors often. They don't verify their ages, and so trafficking is happening in the industry, and now they're terrified that their business model will be uh, threatened.